What is going on guys, it's Ashley here, welcome back to another Wolves video. Today I'm going to be reviewing the game between Wolves and Slovan Bratislava at Molnew in the Europa League. Um, it was a very good win, a very good win, and uh, I'd say we were worthy of the three points. We played very well, and um, um, we, create, we created quite, quite a few chances, and... Uh, <sighs> We were quite unlucky not to score more than one goal, to be honest. I mean, we, we did have a penalty, um, a Ruben Neves penalty saved. That would have put us in front if, if he managed to just, um, stick it in the back of the net, but um, not so. Good save, to be honest, uh, by the keeper. Maybe Neves could have um, put it higher. Uh, maybe it was, was a bit, a bit, bit of an easy height for the keeper. But, nevertheless, it was a good save. Any keeper that saves a penalty, it's a, it's a good save for the keeper. Um, but, we we did, well, obviously we did eventually uh, get the breakthrough in, in what was 12 minutes of stoppage time um, after a lengthy um, break in play for injury. That did allow us time uh, to go on and grab a winner, which Jimenez incidentally uh, did get in the 92nd minute and I felt like we really did deserve it um, because we played well we created some good chances and um, Traore especially he I've, I've said it before he's a far cry um, from from what he was last season I mean last season he was just, just a pace merchant who didn't really do anything else he just ran down the wing used his pace and then once he got to the byline um, or what, once he got into position to cross, he uh, he couldn't really do anything. But uh, but but this season he get he he is his trademark, I guess. Is he, he gets down to the byline and uh, crosses it in nine times out of ten, he actually puts a decent cross in and uh, creates a, a decent chance. And I think we have to give credit to Slovan Bratislava as well because they did play very well and they played very well throughout this group. Um, they've got. Um, they they won a, they they won against uh, Besiktas um, four two a very good result there. Um, they were in front against us, um, and they had value for for their lead. Um, they were, they were playing quite well, and then uh, eventually, uh, luckily we did we did catch up, and then um, we went on to win the game. Uh, a good win against Besiktas, who've been very poor um, uh, th throughout the group stage. Um, and uh, I think they, they are going to go on um, and finish without without a single point, which is very disappointing for them, considering they they, they at the start when the group was the groups were drawn, they were uh, one of the front runners um, uh, for the group. Uh, but instead, Braga um, have been the front runners um, in, instead of Besiktas. After a couple of games, it looked like a Slovan Bratislava were going through, which is um, all credit to them because they've they've played very well throughout the group and they played very well um, despite uh, the two defeats against us. Um, and yeah, um, we had to play we had we had to play um, our best game against them, and um, it's great preparation as well uh, going into a massive game on Sunday as well against Villa. Absolutely massive game, and um, a win will go a long way um, in our confidence going into the game. Um, but yeah, uh, if you did uh, enjoy this uh, this match review, make sure to smash that like button, and I shall see you uh, on Sunday with a review of the Villa game. Until then, goodbye, guys. Yeah.